Hello, my hearties. A very good evening to you. It's just me, Scotty McClue. Lovely to have you with us and dinky do great stuff. It says, Scotty McClue, we've just popped up, of course, at uh, 43, 43. So what's that? Just coming up to 17 minutes to 11 o'clock on Tuesday evening. And I hope you are well. Lovely to have you with us. And a big dinky do from me, Scotty McClue. And uh, come and join us. Follow us, of course. Very, very important. Lots of new TikTok videos uploaded for you. So I hope you'll enjoy every single one of them. Tell 10 to tell 10 to tell 10 to tell 10 that Scotty McClue is live, that this is the big one. And come on and enjoy yourself. Get entertained. Come and entertain the rest of the universe and tell us all about your day. How important is that? Pepe is funny. Dinky do. Lovely to have you with us and a very, very warm welcome. You're watching Scotty McClue and we're live on the big one. Hashtag floaty, first lord of the internet. If you haven't seen my lives before, they are very, very, very special. So never ever scroll, never ever troll. Always come and enjoy yourself here. Hello, Scotty, says the odd gamer. Odd gamer, lovely to have you with us. Dinky do, I get quite excited when I see all these beautiful people coming and joining us. That's what it's all about. This is what a late night chat show should be about. Proper people. How are you, Scotty? We're fine. Thank you very much, Chatter. Hi, Scotty. Dinky do. Good evening, Scotty. Shocking night for the Rangers. Oh, shocking. Shocking. And apparently people are very embarrassed about it. So we're maybe not, you know, rub any salt into the wounds there, I think. Apparently we are not the people tonight. Good evening, Scotty. Yes, indeed. Welcome, welcome. Lovely to have you with us. But these things happen and it will get better, you know. Absolutely. Yes. Very, very important. More likes can attract viewers, it says here. Thank you for all your likes. Evening, Scotty, from Blackpool, down visiting the outlaws. Ah, sure to be. There are one or two outlaws in Blackpool, I can tell you. But there's one or two exceptionally fine people. I used to get picked up on a Saturday night and taken along to all the best places in Blackpool. I was very, very privileged. Thank you, do. Oh, no, I thought I'd been blocked. TikTok world famous. Why would you have been blocked? You know, did you say anything naughty? Fantastic. Scotty sending hugs, wolf plays. You are very, very kind. I thank you. Very, very good of you. And dinky do. Now, who else have we got here? Good evening, buddy. How's your day been? My day has been exceptional today. And we popped up at lunchtime. So you'll be able to catch the first three minutes and we'll get some bits and pieces to you. Fantastic. Good evening, buddy. Dinky do. Thank you very much, Chris. Wonky. Dinky do. What a handsome rapping chap. Dinky do. You're very, very kind. Wonky. I say to you. Oh, thank you for all your help. Did you manage to sort out? I know you've sorted a lot on Wiki for me and many, many, many thanks. Did you manage to split the pages into Scotty McClue so that when people put in Scotty McClue, they get Scotty McClue? So there you are. That would be rather good. Uh, we are the people. Well, Aaron Bell, yes. Apparently, a lot of people are not feeling that we are the people tonight. You know what I'm saying? Oh, dear me. And we were simply the best. Remember me? Fantastic. Of course, we remember you. Thank you for sharing the live. Dinky do. Lovely hat, Scotty. Do you like my Glen Gary? Very, very popular. And, of course, I have on oh, the other side, isn't it? I have my ribbons, my trusty ribbons. Flying in the wind. Fantastic. Dinky do. I love your hat, lady. When you used to see Lieutenant Colonel Colin Mitchell flying through Aden on in his Land Rover with the Bren gun on the back, he would have the ribbons of his Glengarry fluttering in the wind behind him. Wonderful stuff. What's up, says Dylan? Everything's up, Dylan, and nothing is down. Isn't that good? There we are. Always good news here. Follow us as soon as you come on, guys, and share. Very important. Scotty, I'm going to Glasgow soon. Any attractions? Huge attractions. Glasgow in itself is an attraction. And we've got the art galleries. I don't know what all the COVID setup is, but we've got the art galleries. We've got theatres. 
We've got the Transport Museum. We've got the Science Centre. We've got STV, Scottish Television. We've got the BBC, British Broadcasting Corporation. We've got Glasgow University. We've got all the wonderful teaching hospitals. We've got everything in Glasgow just for you. We've got the river. You've got walks by the river walkway, lovely hotels, the Scottish Exhibition Centre, the Armadillo, the Hydro. Oh, we've got so much for you to see. The Burrow Collection. You would love that. Loch Lomond. Ah, oh, dub. Just depends on what takes your fancy lala. Absolutely. Uh, can you get arrested for pushing ducks? Uh, if the parky saw you, he would be dischuffed. Please don't touch the ducks and don't be going feeding them too much bread. You'll very often see a notice, do not feed the ducks. What's the weather like with everything look like it's going to chuck it down in Elgin? Yes, but it hasn't, Peter. You see, sometimes you'll get a wee har coming in from the sea at Lossie there. But the weather, you've got a microclimate there, I'm sure. I know it can get a bit wild in the winter, but, you know, you usually see the rain coming in sort of from the east over Elgin on the road out where the big plane's at the garage. You know what I'm talking about there, Peter. Fantastic. What army or pipe band's the badge, my friend? That's not any army or pipe band. That's my own personal crest. The hand of justice. There we go. Isn't that beautiful? Fantastic. I caught a salmon today. Well done, Sir Hay. You sure it's in season? I'll talk to Wiki, but for now, the stage and legal name. Both bring up your picks and not the judge. I saw that, Wonky. That's so very, very good of you. And did you not also sort Google out as well? I tried to. You can apparently uh, get stuff, what it, you get verified or something, but you know your stuff. Uh, the, when I originally looked at that, and I don't think that guy realized the damage he was doing when he split these pages, but there was a hashtag and a sign beside it. I know I've told you this before, and it said, on no account remove this hashtag. And had we just removed that, I think it would have gone back to the single pages. So when you put in Scotty McClue, you got Scotty McClue. Fantastic. That's the one. But well done, sir. Thank you. Scotty, have you ever played a video game? Do you know the odd one gamer? I haven't. And uh, I used to joke that I played Fortnite once a week. But no, I have never, ever played a video game. Well, once with my friend's son... I did some uh, Formula One motor racing, you know, with the all that stuff. No, steering wheels, I think, with a steering wheel each. Oh, gentlemen, this is Democracy Manifest. You remind me of that guy, Dominicala Lollipop. We are very democratic personified on here. We try to even reach out to the LBTG, LBGTQ community the other day, but it didn't go quite as well as we wanted it to go. But there we go. We will try again. Yes, indeed. I asked Glasgow's the finest uh, junkies arguing in town. Jack, you must not judge others. So there we are. Rangers are out of the CL, Scotty. I know, Debesa. What can I say? Very difficult to say anything that will make it better. You know what I'm saying to you, dear boy. Where is Hadrian's Wall? Hadrian's Wall starts at Newcastle and goes over towards Carlisle. So there you are, Hadrian's Wall. It runs along what we call the Old Military Road, and it starts just outside Carlisle. It starts, I would say, probably around Naworth, am I right? Yes, uh, about there you can see the start of the wall. And, uh, of course, it would have run right over to, I would imagine, Port Carlisle, that sort of thing. But you've got Wells End over on Tyneside, and that's the wall. But you can get a good look at a good bit of it and stand up on it, I tell you. Uh, I think a lot of people nicked the stones to build houses in the old days, you know. 
For all the English viewers, STV is the Scottish branded ITV 1K. Thank you for that. I should have mentioned that. Sometimes because I've been so used to broadcasting to regional areas at a time. And then, of course, because Scotty McClue became so popular, they put all the radio stations together. We love that. Uh, now, in Cumbria, buddy, yes, absolutely. Thanks, mate. What about the East End? Barrowland, the West... Bro yes, Dominical, yes, you can go to the East End and enjoy yourself there. Have a look round Easter House. And go to the shops and the beach and all that sort of thing. Sorry, Scotty, not at all, guy. Hey, loving the hat. Do you like the old Glengarry dinky do? And I'm wearing it properly. Some of our more gallus comrades would have it down like that. <laughs> you know, that's an idea. Dinky do, Scotty. Where is the Green Goblin? The Green Goblin is Lancashire. Uh, free Palestine and free Israel as well. Tell them to stop chucking ordnance at each other. I was just looking at the serious damage out in um, the South, South Arabia there down at Eden. And I was thinking, you know, it's 54 years since the Argyles had to be put into Eden to create law and order. There we are. Incredible stuff with Colonel Mitchell. Uh, you've not had the hat on all day now, have you? Yes, I have, Kulelo. Yes, indeed. We don't take the hat off, you know. The sky is pure black. Whereabouts, Peter, in Elgin? Ah, that's it. Mind you, it can get. You can get the odd downpour. Just watch the Elgin to Lossy Road if it's suddenly you get a downpour. No, no going too fast. Be careful. Yes, let's free it from Hamas, says uh, Iona. There we are, Iona, yes, indeed. Uh, what's your favourite pint? Well, my favourite pint is a pint of water. Cheers. Ah, I used to enjoy quality beers, you know, the, 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 the real ales. But uh, then I gave up beer and went on to cider. And then about, I don't know, seven years ago, something like that, I just gave up the whole lot. There we go. That's it. Thoughts on the UN climate report? Yes, I think we need to not go over the top. We have to look at the mitigation here. The earth has been warming up since the ice age. That's why we don't have the ice age. Yes, there's going to be climate change. But remember, what the scientists don't seem to be getting is that the Earth resets itself, you know, and there's nothing you can do about that. You know, putting out your fire and not smoking and driving a smaller car won't make any difference. Your biggest pollutants and polluters are uh, China and the United States. You know, I don't know who's coming to the conference in Glasgow. I haven't been invited, uh, which surprises me you know, because of the importance of McClue in the world. But um, very, very, very interesting what's going on there. And of course, green, be wary of everything being pushed at you that's green because, you know, action equals reaction, first law of physics. And uh, if you've got, I mean, why are we not getting free electricity if we've got renewables? It should be free. Crest, that's the name it was in my head. Thank you for clearing that up. There we are, Chris. Scotty, I'm in air in Scotland. There's no E in that one. Uh, great place. Absolutely, yes. Absolutely. And then, of course, in Yorkshire, you've got air and air and Calder. I used to work for Radio Air, A-I-R-E, beside us, um, Besides, sorry, I'm reading the next one here. Beside um, Yorkshire Television. That was what I was going for. Kulelo says, do you know the story about the Red Hand of Ulster? I did know it, Kulelo. I haven't got it right on the tip of my tongue right now. Fantastic. That's not the Red Hand of Ulster. That's the Hand of Justice from a man of laws in uh, Viking. There we are. Now, who have we got here? Uh, they did it because, as a person, don't associate with Scottish characters, controversial use, 
You as a person, wonky. What are we doing here? Not sure what you mean by that one, wonky. You have to do more description in that one. Uh, love you, Scotty. Thank you very much, ourself. Uh, favorite books, Scotty? I have so many. I'm reading about, um, there's a wonderful author called Michael Fry, a factual historian. And uh, his stuff is outstanding. He wrote about the Scottish Empire, you know, and I've been having a look at that. And also things like um, the Enlightenment, stuff like that, all about Scottish affairs, serious stuff, very, very good. Well, well, what's the crake, Michael Money? The crake is always going good style here, as you so rightly say, and you so well know. There we are. Uh, Scotty, I'm sneaking out tonight to go up to Ports Downhill at 3.30. Wish me luck. Harrison, what's going on? Scotty, it's been too long. How are you? Dear dinky do. There we are. Now, Wonky, uh, what have we got here? Scotty, what's your opinions on bald people? Uh, well, I, you know, I'm not going to say anything against myself, although I might have six hairs. There we are. Uh, it meant because the editors said, McClure, oh, I see what you mean. Yes, 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 yes. Good man yourself, Irishman here. Yes, indeed, Michael. God save Ireland, I say to you now. There we are. Fantastic. And uh, we'll get a pint of the black stuff if I ever went on it again. Now then, uh, who have we got here? Ariana has joined us. Dinky doo. Uh, fellow Irishman now then. Scotty, we're just enjoying life and creating a childhood. Harrison, are we not all just? God save Ireland indeed, Scotty. Yes, D10. Legend says get over ourselves. Yes, get over yourselves. Can you do a rap? Well, I won't do one tonight, but I did one for you last week, and I uploaded the video. There we are, the rapping chap, just off the top of the head. Scotty, would you rather live in Afghanistan or Yemen? I would only live in them if I felt I could get them back to the way they were in 1965. You know, both Afghanistan and Yemen were highly, highly civilized countries that were a pleasure to visit. You could call in in your aeroplane and all that sort of stuff. You could get the boat I mean, Aden was one of the world's most important harbors. The only harbor I think that was most imp more important than Aden was uh, was New York. You know, Aden was absolutely pivotal. You know, uh, quite a tough climate, I think. Uh, Unknown says you deleted the video of you responding to LGBTQ. No, 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 no. It's on TikTok videos. You should see it there with a bit of luck. Lest somebody else has deleted it. We had a pretty sort of wild, crazy character that was trying to hog it all and shouting and swearing. And, you know, I mean, how much good does that do LGBTQ? I don't know. There we are. No, no, I don't think we have unknown. It should be there. Have another look. Uh, do a rap, says Yamal. I've done it. You'll see it on the TikTok videos. Uh, he's a picked a picked, how very interesting, Cam. A picked, I couldn't find it. No, it should be there. Was that me in the stripey shot responding and saying, why don't we get rid of labeling altogether? Did you see the one of the crazy woman shouting and swearing? Celtic or Rangers says Robert Power. Robert, my best advice to you is go and see them both play. Like, I'm glad you didn't see Rangers play tonight, but go and see them both play and then just make up your mind and it's not cast in stone. Uh, where are you from? I'm from Scotland. You can tell by my voice. Scotty, what's your opinion on wearing deodorant? I think we should all stop using the stuff. Well, Deeks, I don't wear any squirty stuff. Haven't for years and years and years. If I'm going out to work, which is most of the time, I'll sometimes pop a little bit of roll-on on under the oxters just to kind of keep everything fairly fresh there. Uh, who do I support? I don't support any football team. They are whereabouts in Scotland, on the west coast of Scotland. 
There we are, Rangers unbeaten last year. Bad start. What's changed, Kalelo? You've got to just go with the flow. These things can change. Ask Sir Alex Ferguson. Look at the way he transformed teams. You know, wonderful stuff. And he said, football. <laughs> you know, it can change. It can turn on a sixpence. Here was me thinking you were American. Michael Mooney, what a lovely thing to say. Well, I wouldn't mind being American, my fellow Americans. The only reason I am not hashtag POTUS, President of the United States, is because I'm not an American citizen. There you are, and I'll tell you that. You'll see that here. Thoughts on Saudi Arabia, the economy, Saudi head of state, would you visit? Yes, of course I would visit Saudi Arabia. McClue is welcome everywhere. But I feel desperately, desperately sorry for the Yemenis. Maybe we need to send the Argyles back in. There we are. Now, uh, that's his cousin, America McClue. Yes, indeed. Well done, unknown. Uh, Ferguson is my god. Yes, absolutely. Well, wonderful. Um, you know, I mean, a wonderful guy. He really, really is. And, of course, I worked at Century Radio in 1998 which was just, oh, just across the ship canal from Old Trafford. Uh, and uh, they were winning. Man U were winning everything. There we are. Fantastic. They're going to win the Champions League, Scotty. Absolutely. Roadman. Roadman. Thoughts on the current state of Scottish education? Scottish education is doing remarkably well. It's still the finest education anywhere in the world. So don't be falling for everything you read about it. And it has coped incredibly well with the pandemic. And we paid tribute to all the teachers and the schools' managements and all the schools for the wonderful, wonderful way they've dealt with the pandemic. And, of course, to the young people themselves, a very big thank you for the wonderful way they've coped wearing their masks and doing their best to social distance, very much a tough time for them. Yankee McClue. Yes, indeed. Da -da 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 -dee -dee. I'm next in line for the presidency in the United States. Are you an American citizen, Michael Money, now there? Or are you just talking out of your shillelagh? Uh, Scotland can't keep the pound sterling. Yes, it certainly can uh, kill. Go back to the drawing board. Go and listen to former governors of the Bank of England, and you'll find Scotland can very much keep the pound sterling. It's not, I mean, a currency is never an issue. You can always, uh, you know, because money is money. I can remember being in Ireland when they had the punt or the pund. There you go. Love Man United. I love you. Thank you, Sticky. Very, very kind of you. Uh, a shout out for my friend, Zach. No bother at all. To support universal basic income, 300 a person, the Lib Dems are backing. Well, uh, yeah, that would be obviously a help, you know, but I'm afraid... These parties, these sort of minority parties now, I mean, Scotland used to be such a liberal country, falling down with liberalism from mid-Victorian times. Uh, so there we are. Yes, Kulelio, we'll not go into that, but I quite understand where you are coming from. I think there are inquiry, inquiries ongoing. Sure, look enough, Americans claim to be Irish. Sure, I can claim to be American. Yes, but are you an American citizen was what I asked you. You are saying slight difference of just claiming to be American. Scotty needs his own star on Hollywood's Walk of Fame. Unknown, you are very, very, very kind. Uh, do you like traditional Cornish pasties? I don't like traditional Cornish pasties, no. I adore, adore traditional Cornish pasties. I had two not all that long ago. And uh, they are outstanding, the goddess. Am I right in thinking they were made for the tin miner's lunch? Is that true? And the fisherman's lunch. There we are. They've got vegetables in them. Do you like Hercule Poirot? Oui, oui, oui. Je t'adore, hein? Hercule Poirot. Il est un bon investigateur. Oui, un, um, uh, un uh, 
Privat Investigator. <laughs> wow. Uh, there we are. Not all the Irish through and through. What about them now, Michael? Now, what about yourself there talking? What was the word you used to say yourself? Dot. Ah, autodidactic. I'm an autodidact. And I'm also a polymath. So you can check that out. There you go. Austin Powers. Well, the Austin Powers were, they went as small as an 848. And then you were up to um, a 993 and a 109. Sorry, a 998 and a 1098. And that was you up to the 1100. Then you had a 1500. Then you had uh, what came after that. I think then you would be into um, yeah, 1800 and then 2 litres and 2.2. So that's your Austin power in general. Uh, Scotty, how are you, my good friend? Those 1800 was a good one. There's the old uh, Morris Oxford engine. There we are, Austin, Cambridge, the A60. Scotty, how are you, my good friend? Tory in Shuffle. How lovely to have you with us in Dinky Doo. Apologies have not been on lately, Scotty. Oh, you're well, Graham Hogg. How lovely to have you with us and a big Dinky Doo. The tin miners eat the pasties holding the gnarled part then threw it away, it saved cleaning hands. Ah, I might have nibbled a bit of gnarled, I think, to be honest with you. Right, I'm going to have to go. Hello, Scotty, how are you? Beautiful day here in Washington, D.C. Patriots fan, we adore Washington, D.C. We love it. He meant Austin Powers, the self-titled comedy. Ah, I thought he was talking about the power of the Austin cars. Guys, do you realize that there's a new show started on Saturday night on YouTube? And just very modest start, 11 o'clock at night, and it's just called Cars, presented by my good self. So get yourself onto that. Hello from Holland. Yeah, come into house. I will turn cup of tea happen. I'm feeling my clumping. Yes, indeed. Dinky do, everybody. Dinky do, Jamie. Lovely to have you. Dinky do, Mikey boy. Good of you to join us. Five more minutes, guys, then I have to just disappear like snow off a dike. Been wonderful to have you with us. Why would a dike have snow? I don't know. David McFadden, dinky do, lovely to have you with us. And a very, very warm welcome. Thank you for the good Dutch. Yeah, he's good, yeah. Uh, danke. Uh, thank you very much, I say to you. Now then, uh, just a little bit of Dutch to keep us going, you know. Any plans for next week to re in Schofel? Well, we might have to change because a lot of work on next week, so I shall be so busy. This is my leisure time popping up to see every single one of you and to say dinky-doo, of course. Caught you a little late, Sarge. Geo dog, not to worry. We had a lovely, lovely chat at lunchtime. And you are a resident geologist. How outstanding. Can you speak German? Nein, ich deutsche sprechen. Ich bin ein Auslander. Nicht verstehen. So there you are. Uh, now, who have we got here? Debbie Dinky Doo. Lovely to have you with us. And a very, very warm welcome from Scotty McClue. This has been an amazing pop-up tonight, guys. Very, very, very special. Especially when there's been football on. Scotty, what's the story behind the great hat? Ah, Graham. There's a lifetime of stories behind this hat. I can tell you. Loving the hat, Scotty. Thank you, Mikey boy. Scotty, I-E, not a Y. It's not as if we're short of it around the internet. Follow us, guys. Thank you, the Radical 80s guy, for following. Guys, so good of those that follow. I mean, a lot of you just don't bother, I've noticed, but please do start bothering. You should be following Scotty McClue. Three more minutes. Then we have to dash off. But lots and lots of TikToks. Please like every single one of them and follow me as soon as you can. There we are. Are you wearing a kilt to match, my good man? Haven't got the kilt on tonight. Goodbye, Scotty. Stay safe, my good friend. Not a problem at all. I'm going to give you a tune on the squeeze box. I know you like it. I think we'll do Again I Wear a Baron's Ear. This is excellent stuff. Are we ready, Patriots fan? 
This is for you and for Geo Dog. I'm working towards completing my PhD. I often work deep into the night. Ah, Geodog, you will be getting that. Dr. Geodog, is it in Geo? That's what I ask you. Are you doing a doctorate in Geo? Make sure there's somebody clever enough at the university to mark it. <laughs> right, here we go. Are you ready? <laughs> Bravo, bravo. La Hoop, you're missing the point there. They were fighting for freedom, but they were planning terrorism. Even old Arthur Griffiths, the man that started it all off, he was talking about sending a plane over to bomb London. You need to check out your history. They were dangerous, dangerous men, more than capable of terrorism. So don't be seeing them in any way as saints. Yes, I agree with you. There weren't too many saints coming out of Westminster towards Ireland at the time. But these guys, mark my words, they were dangerous and a lot of them were into terror. Okay, so have a look. I mean, even the 1916, the post office was an act of terror. A lot of people were very, very scared and very frightened. The attack on Lord Nelson's statue in Dublin, all these sort of things. You know, you've got to look at the big picture here, Lahoub, and not be going defending people who were very, very dangerous just because you feel they were working for your cause. Okay. We need to look at that. You've got to admit that. I mean, I admitted about the black and tans. I admitted about Churchill's policies. You need to start meeting me halfway on this lobe. Yes, terror. Think about it. There we go. Uh, thank you, kind sir. I think you do, Geodog. No, no, you are going to do big stuff. Brilliant. Best way to close the day. Tory and Chauffel. I love to have you with us. Fantastic, says Patriots fan. Not always of truth, I was not shouting for it. So there we are. The English created the IRA. No, no. The Irish created the IRA. It grew out of the Republican Brotherhood. England did not have a Republican Brotherhood. I can assure you. There we are. So stick to the facts, please, 20 Regal. As uh, Scotty, they were heroes and would always be labelled as such. Yes, they might be labelled as such, but that's sanitising them. Yeah, these guys were into big terror and didn't care who got hot. My father wore a hat like that. No good night song, of course. We never leave without the good night song and the goodbye song. So calm yourself down, La Hoop. Have a look at the facts. Take it all in and say, I need to not push my luck with McClue because he knows his stuff. There we are. But I agree, they shouldn't have been executing them all. Uh, now, here we are. You should wear your Glen Gary more often. I thank you, dear dog. I've got my ribbons. Oh, other shoulder. I keep doing that. There we are. I have my ribbons for you here. Dinky do. Thank you for your lovely rose, Graham. Dinky do. Right. I'll sing you the goodbye song. Are we ready? Join in. Goodbye, everybody. Goodbye. Take care, everybody, as you go. 
Goodbye, everybody. Auf Wiedersehen. Au revoir. And a cheerio. Cheerio, everybody. Take great care of yourself. La hope it's nothing personal. You get your facts sorted out. I have to disagree. Uh, have a good night. Not at all, Lahoop. Of course you'll disagree, because as far as you're concerned, you thought they were right, but look at what else was happening. Uh, good night, Scotty Season. Always look for the big picture. Sleep well, my respected friend, and you, my true, fabulous, and respected friend, I salute you, sir, for your decency, for your humanity and for your genius. That's just for starters. Good night, God bless everybody, and ta-ra-las! Dinky-doo!